Hey, and welcome to the Toadstead. Well, it's another edition of the Schizophrenic Shop. And let's see, we'll take a look around and see what we, going on, we got going on. Probably the main thing is we're hanging peanuts. There's, oh, a little bit less than half, actually a little bit more than half our crop is now hanging in the shop. When I'm done, I'm probably going to have to take the flag and take the bicycles down because as you can see, we're uh, pretty getting pretty full up. <laughs> so when we're done, this will all be covered. We do this because we dry them in here for a week after we pull them out of the ground to uh, get ready. Then the next step is we'll take them down and actually strip the nuts off the plants. But that's what we got going on, and uh, we're tying them up. There's a bundle here waiting for the next batch, and we'll tie it up and hang it. So that's what's going on on the, on the bench. And we've got some oak beams over here that a friend of ours gave us that we, uh, he's a trucker, and uh, well, we ends up with lots of extra dunnage, and we take the dunnage and uh, make things from it, except for this one piece of poplar in here. They're all red and white oak, and we run them through the planer, and uh, we're actually going to be building more of these chairs. These uh, I built these for years and sold them, and we're going to bring that back. These are made out of pine, but we're going to be bringing them back. In fact, I'll take you over here. You can see the... <laughs> The engine hoist is out because we just delivered a generator. I had to hoist that into the truck. Got a couple solar panels here that we're doing some stuff with. And then back here, it's a little dark, but I think it'll pick it up. These are some of the parts for those chairs I was showing you. And we're getting ready to set up the uh, router table to do the work there. And then we had this come in, this big cabinet. And it's just a big old steel. Let me get back around. Oh, well, there's... A bunch of Asian long beans hanging from the bicycle. And this is some a, a small bit of our seed stock. So I'll be pulling those out and putting them away for next year. And we just get a big old, just a big old cabinet opens up. And it's going to replace some of this open shelving. I'm not a big fan of open shelving because it's, it's hard to keep all that clean. And I know as, uh, as dirty as this place looks, we do try and keep things pretty clean in between jobs. And after a while, when you're, when you're running, you know, the table saw and some other tools, you get dust, a lot of dust in here. And I just don't like how that, uh, how the open shelving allows the dust to get everywhere. So we snatch these kind of pieces of furniture anytime we can and we'll get it all fixed up and it'll take place of one of these shelves uh, let's see what else we got back here oh there's a uh a two meter yagi antenna that we're putting together and it'll be ready uh for the springtime i've got an omnidirectional antenna up now for our two meter rig but being able to point right at this large tower that's about 40, 50 miles away will allow us to use that repeater when we want to. And uh, for those of you who know, we have an online business that we do. So there's uh, there's peanuts hanging over my shipping department. <laughs> but that's our shipping department. <laughs> so, you know, just... It's actually kind of typical to have this kind of thing going on. The peanuts, this will be a... That's a antique weasel that i'm going to be re-engineering reverse engineering so we just got that out got some parts being made by a friend of mine who has a 3d printer but uh you know just there's always stuff going on and usually it kind of goes from oh my god we're buried to empty then back to oh my god we're buried <laughs> but i had a lot of people they kind of dug the uh schizophrenic shop stuff so we figured we'd show you that and of course we're also canning it's that time of year so we've got our canning equipment out and as we pull stuff out of the garden and we get enough to fill whether we're doing water bath or pressure we do we use this vessel for both and uh let's see what else yeah there's some pear butter sitting back there that just haven't finished i gotta, gotta finish labeling it and put it up in up in the pantry 
And uh, what else is interesting going on here? Well, we're making soap. This is something we do kind of on the side. And right there, and you can see up there, is a whole bunch of uh, basically fat left over from cooking. And we save it and we'll render it down. And uh, got a bunch of it rendered and put away. This will be the next batch that gets rendered down. <laughs> Our chickens. Yeah, they're always looking for something to eat. But that's just another day in the schizophrenic shop. Thanks a lot for coming along. We'll see you next time around.